first day out today, the sky is so blue and it's going to be like 66 I think, so I'm really excited for that. Okay you guys, it is about 12.35ish and I just got done with school for the day. I'm literally so ecstatic because I'm finally done for the weekend. It has been the longest week ever and so much school and I'm just so ready to not do school for, for two days straight. So now I'm going to just like go brush up and get ready for the day. And yeah, I'm so happy with the weekend. I can't even tell you how excited I am. Ah, yay. I don't usually cry at all, but wow is it always close, ranging from a movie scene to main of people in my dreams the last to use the morning facial moisturizing lotion because I know that I'm going to be out in the sun because today actually I haven't even said my plans today I'm going to the park with some friends to make Valentine so that'll be super fun but it's a like warm nice day for once so I know I'll need some sunscreen so I'm just gonna use some of this just a little bit it goes a long way okay morning lotion on and then now I need to do my makeup do my hair and decide what I'm wearing so we gotta get into this already okay guys I'm gonna do a quick little get ready with me I'm gonna use this elf jelly pop primer as well and I'm just gonna use a little bit of this and this will hopefully help my makeup to just stay on all day it's kind of sticky at first but then I think it really does help your makeup stay on so I'm gonna just wear some of this and it smells amazing you guys smells like watermelon and it's just like my favorite smell ever. I think I did figure out my outfit, so that's really good. If I recall, was feeling of being alone. I don't know if where I'm going is in far, but in case I go, no need to be stressed, gotta take it home, is there. I really Since we left, I guess it just makes sense to what the reasoning was when I said In case I go, no need to be stressed, gotta take it home, it's there I really miss the shade of blue makeup is done and now I'm gonna go do my hair and get ready fully and yeah what time is it it's one o'clock I think we have to leave around like 1 40 1 45 so yeah okay you guys I am all ready and I love how the outfit turned out so I can't wait to show you the full OOTD but yeah, it feels so good to get ready, honestly, and just, like, look nice. Because I have so many home days that I just, like, I don't know. My confidence levels definitely go way up when I actually get ready. So that makes me very happy. But yeah, also it's kind of like a Valentine's Day outfit with pink. But yeah, I thought that would be super fun. I'm also going to do my hair super quickly, I think. So I'm going to do the braids on both sides. And yeah, that's what I'm up to currently. Okay, both sides of my hair are done and I am all ready to go. Say hi, Grace Ann. Hi! 
Some of it. Yeah, in the cooler. I'm currently just walking around the park while we wait for our friend to come. So that's what I'm up to at the moment. It's actually a problem. I'm so glad I got to go on that picnic with friends and I didn't end up vlogging much yesterday so I'm sorry about that but I remember my last weekend in the life it was like 30 minutes so hopefully this one will be shorter which would be really nice so I am just going to get started my day I'm going to open the windows in here and then I'm going to take the sheets off my bed I've just been kind of having a resting morning like just kind of Instagram chill morning but I think that's really good to have every once in a while and my weekends are definitely my like relaxing and resetting time so I really enjoyed it honestly weekend so i'll definitely vlog if anything interesting happens my only plan for today is to go to my grandparents tonight and i'll probably hang out outside with my sister some because literally 71 here today which is insane so i really want to spend some time outside today and maybe take some photos i don't know 
Okay, so now I'm just going to wash my face. And today, since I wore a ton of makeup yesterday, I'm going to just use the CeraVe soap. Sometimes I'll use the CFO cleanser, but since I have on a ton of makeup, the cleanser doesn't get it off as well. I like to use that more when it's just like a chill morning. But yeah, so today I'm going to use the soap. Also, I think that I just said that the soap is, is CeraVe. It's not. It's Cetaphil. Now I'm just washing off all the soap on my face. Okay, we are done. I am going to use the Morning Facial Moisturizing Lotion again today. This is just the brand Up and Up. It's just like, I don't know, I don't know where you get it. But I'm just going to use some of this since I will probably be out in the sun again today. And I just want to make sure to protect my skin from sunburn and yeah. Okay, that is done and now I'm going to probably get dressed. Alright you guys, I'm all dressed and ready. I need to do my hair, but I may get more fully ready later. I'm not quite sure yet, but I am going to add the two braids in my hair. So I'll update you once I do that. Okay, hair is done. I have the two little braids now and they're so cute. So yeah, I think I'm going to go make an early lunch. It's like 105, but might as well make lunch because I have nothing better to do and I'm hungry. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do now. Place you from a ways. My heart, it started racing. It's like 72, so we just kind of want to take advantage of the warm weather. And yeah, that's what we're up to right now. Let's go. If you could read my mind. Will you make your way towards mine? We're at the park. Say hi, Macy. We've been chilling at the little, like, little park area and I store, so that's been super fun. There's music going on in the background, so I'm gonna make this short. But we got home and I'm about to roll some oatmeal balls, so I'll show you guys the finished product when I'm done. These are the finished oatmeal balls. <laughs> since it's like after dinner we did this every saturday night but yeah i'm excited to see my grandparents i'll show you guys the valentine's that i made them i'll try to vlog as much as possible but we will see so yes that's your update for now and yeah sorry i haven't been good at vlogging but yeah 
Also, y'all, earlier I literally got honked at by a car for wearing this outfit. I don't know. I just got honked at when I was trying to walk across the street to get home. And that's just so disgusting. So I was just really mad about that because like, this outfit isn't like super revealing or anything. So yeah, that's a little story time. It really annoyed me because I was just trying to get home and they honked at me. And yeah, that always literally bugs me so badly. So that's my little story time for today, but it was really annoying. <laughs> currently getting ready for bed and I'm just going to use this CeraVe facial moisturizing lotion. Uh, it's like a night cream and this stuff literally saved my skin a while back. It was insane. My skin had this episode and I don't know what it was caused by. I think it was just the cold weather but my skin literally got to like the worst ever. Like it was scaly. It was like all in my chin. It was super inflamed and I'd never had that happen before. I'd never had dry skin really on my face before i've always had oily skin so it really bothered me it was like itchy and burning all the time and my lips were dry as well so it was just like a horrible combo and it was so red so it just really made me feel so insecure and gross and i just hated it and so i finally like i tried some different products but they didn't work wonderfully so i finally decided to try this stuff and it literally saved me like <laughs> Within a few days, my skin went back to normal when it had been getting worse and worse and worse. And I could not be more thankful, seriously. This stuff is amazing. So if you have dry skin, this is a must-have. Like, you need to go to your store and pick this up because it truly did help me so incredibly much. And I just am obsessed with this. So CeraVe, please sponsor me. But yes, I love it so much. I think tonight I'm actually going to do some more skincare than normal. And I'm going to use the Bliss Youth Got This Retinol Cream. They sent this to me a while back and I really like it and so I think I'm just going to try some more of it tonight. I haven't tried it in a little bit but it like advises to use it every other night at first. So I'm just going to use a little bit on my skin. It smells super good so I like that about it a lot. This is the earliest I've gone ready for bed in a while. I'm literally such a late night person. I've been staying up till 2 or later every night which is so unhealthy because I get up at like 9 or 9.30 so I only get, I get less than 8 hours of sleep every single night and I'm exhausted. So, I think I'm going to go to bed early tonight. It's literally only 12.38, so it's so early for me. But I think I'm going to try to go to bed by like 1. I finished the book that I read last night. It was so good. And now I'm actually rereading a book, Adorkable by Kugio Gorman. I literally love this book so freaking much. It's one of my absolute favorites. I've read it before, and I just really wanted to reread it because it's so precious and so wholesome, and I'm obsessed with it. So I've just been rereading that tonight, and then now I think I'm going to just watch some YouTube before I go to bed, catch up on social media notifications, and then head to bed as soon as possible. Trains keep running. Hey guys, it's about 1.10 a.m. so I'm going to head to bed now and I'll see you tomorrow for a third day of vlogs for the Sunday and my weekend in the life. So, yeah. Hearts keep breaking, I keep writing songs about things that are out of my Hey guys, good morning slash good afternoon. We just have been watching church and I've just been working. I posted on Instagram, so I'll put that in here. And yeah, so right now I'm going to get dressed and get ready for my day and I need to clean more and I have so much to do today. So I'm just gonna take you through all it. These are the clothes that I'm going to change into. Okay, so we have changed into the outfit. I'll show you a full OOTD later, but I need to find some jewelry to go with this. So I'm probably just gonna try to find like a pair of gold earrings. Gold is like kind of my go-to with this color palette with like the black and the burgundy. I'd probably wear black, but I also don't have many pairs of black earrings. So I usually go for gold instead. Okay, I found this pair of really thin gold earrings. So I'm probably going to wear these. It's either these or these little mini ones that I just found as well. They're like that. They kind of look like crullers from Krispy Kreme. I'm not going to lie. But I'm trying to decide which earring that I like better. I think I like the thin gold better, so I'm just going to put these in. I control, but I pretend they're not, and then wonder why the outcome's not. Okay, there we go. So they are in. I think those actually look really good. They're very small, but I just think they're really pretty. So yes, I'm going to do my hairstyle real quick and finish getting ready. I need to also brush my teeth and wash my face and all that stuff. So I think that I'm going to do that first. What I planned for Oh, cause lately I tend to win so Okay, these
the slight makeup is done. I don't really know why my chin is kind of breaking out today, but we're just going to ignore that and be confident despite your skin. That is your reminder for today. So I'm gonna do my hair super quickly, so I will be right back when it is finished. Hair is done, I have the two little braids again, and now I'm actually thinking that I'm going to make my bed because I haven't done that in a really long time. And I just love having a like made bed when I go to sleep at night. So I think that's what I'm gonna do because it's also just a really good habit to get into. Maybe it's dumb it and then seem so scary. bed I'm done making it and it looks so nice oh. really quickly i am an ambassador for a really really cute small business it is called shop cindy jane and you guys have seen my sweatshirt before it says feel your feelings on it it's white i'll put it in here but it's so cute and she sent me another one and guys i am so obsessed it is so cute it has a little text message bubble on it and it says you are loved and i just absolutely love it i love the color i love the like message of it and the text message like it looks so professional and so amazing go buy from her she's absolutely amazing she's the kindest person i have a code so i'll put in here and i'm not like supposed to put this in here i just really 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 love her small business and wanted to share it with you guys because i shared a lot on my instagram but i don't really on my youtube as much because i don't do sponsorships on here as much so i just wanted to share that and i'm an ambassador for a bunch of little companies so please go check that out on my instagram at as well blogs i have a ton of codes for really cute small businesses and such and yeah i'm just going to hang this up and put it in my closet actually another one right here i'm not an ambassador for them but i've done they've sent me stuff and i've taken pictures for them it's a small business called like honey ave and i absolutely love it it says jesus loves you on the front and then on the back it has like a dear person behind you message and i love that i'm so obsessed with it and it's so soft so definitely go shop their store i just i felt like saying that so yeah i'm gonna hang this one up and put it in there also it's actually one of my favorite hoodies so i just love it I'm not the one that's crazy. You okay, guys, I'm back in my room. I had lunch and I've just been working. I wanted to also mention that what I've been doing is I was uploading a design to Redbubble and I didn't tell you guys about this. I told like all my Instagram, like everything's on there, but I haven't really mentioned it in a video because I haven't really had like the opportunity to. But I did start a Redbubble shop and I have a bunch of really fun designs on there. I'll have to show you guys on my computer. But yeah, I just uploaded a sticker or like a design to there and it's super cute and I drew it on my iPad. And that's just been a really fun project for me because I've been wanting to do that for forever. So having that like little side project has been really fun for me. So if you want to support me, definitely go buy stuff from my shop. I have a bunch of different designs. I'll show you really quickly. This is my shop, so I have a little banner, and then I just have a bunch of different designs, and they come on different things like notepads and hats and mouse pads and all that stuff. And I have Joshua Bassett and Conan Gray and little different quotes, Alexander23. I have so much different stuff on here, Olivia Rodrigo, Rory from Gilmore Girls, Just Mariano stuff, Emily Gilmore. So 
definitely go check out my shop. I love it and I would really appreciate all of your support. You can follow me on there. I appreciate that so, so, so much. You can favorite my stuff on there. So if you don't want to spend money on it, if you just favorite my products that you really like or just follow my shop, that literally means so much to me. So I would really appreciate that. I will definitely leave the link down below. And yeah, it's really exciting. So yes, so that's what I've been up to. I've just been putting that design on there. Cause I just finished that this morning so now I'm going to do my weekly planner and I did this in my last video because I did a Sunday reset video so I'm just checking off a few things from yesterday and now I'm just going to peel off the sheet and start a new one for the upcoming week so that is done and on this thing usually I write assignments and Instagram stuff yeah I think I just write assignments Instagram and classes like for Instagram I write when I post and when I post a reel and then I write out all the assignments that are that I have to do every single day and then I write down the ones that are all due on Sunday so I'm just going to go through and write on this plan really quickly because I just love doing this on Sundays and it helps me feel super organized for the upcoming week and I'll probably time lapse this so yes <music> I get my hopes up every time And I don't wanna be, be the only try I wrote down most of the base stuff that I know I have to do And then now I'm gonna open up my computer And look on my different class websites And like Google Classroom And see what my assignments are gonna be for this week So that I can go ahead and just write that down And know what's going on with that Cause that'll be super helpful for me So that's the current plan right now be, be the only troll to find I just wish I'd seen The price tag for my heart breaking Was it worth all that waiting When I always knew just how I felt Yeah, I'm looking back Okay, I currently have everything ran down for the week that I know of So I am done with that task Which is going to be super nice for me this upcoming week and I don't know what I'm going to do next. I really need to edit, so I might do that. I'm not really sure, but yes. I'm currently chasing the sunset, but it's low-key gone. Get the past and I feel regret, so I wanna walk on the block, see where we met. Try to forget that you went on with someone. Yeah, it's pretty much gone, and I'm shaking because it's so cold. So, let me make sure you can't see it from over here, and then I'm going to head home because I'm freezing. Yeah, you can't see it well. Okay, I'm turning around because I'm so cold right now. Now since then, maybe it's better if I never love. So I don't have to open up. And you don't have to lose my trust. Every time. Why am I always getting so attached? When I know that we're gonna crash. Now I wish I could turn you back into someone. so much for coming along on this weekend in my life with me it was a bit insane but that's okay so yeah i'm super tired it's like 1 30 so i'm gonna hit the bed now make sure to follow my instagram at as well kate blog and subscribe on here and i'll see you in the next one bye guys